doing some like personal things for example working out getting it's a Monday getting myself back on track on my Peloton workout journey and and I was doing a deep dive into my journal time today and I came across this first it's a verse that we all know very very well and it is James 1 it's like James 1 and 2 around that that area dear brothers and sisters when troubles of any kind come your way consider it an opportunity for great joy for you know that when your faith is tested your endurance has a chance to grow so let it grow for when your endurance is fully developed you will be perfect and complete needing nothing what like we've heard that you know count it all joy you know to suffer or whatever the other versions say in the name of jesus and like all these things and it's just that last part lacking nothing or needing nothing <sighs> moments of what's it say what, what does the exact word say moments of troubles and testing who would have ever thought that our perspective should be one of counting it joy like who wants to count a moment where it's like I gotta live through this grief I gotta live through burying uh burying somebody I love I gotta I gotta live through this illness I have to live through this thing like who would ever even think that and the bible clearly states that a moment of trouble almost feel like it builds up our ability to trust in a faithful God, right? Our ability to endure, right? To to have, to build up patience and wisdom and like all these fruits of the spirit, right? And I'm just looking like, that's so good, right? Like, Sometimes we try to run away from issues and problems and those are the things that build us up. So I don't know. I was just like writing about that today as I am like really struggling finding the time, not even the time, the discipline of time to say, okay, today I'm going to write. I always seem to find something else to do and I'm just like, I really need to write toward this book. So that's neither here nor there, but I'm wearing my Skims, um... I don't even know what this is called. I think this is like the Jersey tank or whatever. And it fits really nice. This is a size medium. I am a bit hot, which kind of sucks because, y'all, I can't wear it. Like, not that I can't, but I am on the worship team tonight. You know, I got to cut my arms a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So, but if you don't follow me on Instagram, I suggest you do. My, like, bathroom door is all open. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I've been doing keto for about a week and a half or so. And I just made these, like, low-carb quesadilla with, like, Beyond Burger meat in it. And, um, I'm about to have it with some Fodak... <laughs> For Roger project, oh my god, y'all, don't make fun of me, please don't judge me. A uh, plant based cream, creamery sour cream. This is the brand. I need to get my nails done, it's really ridiculous. And I'm about to eat this and then I'm gonna go because I said I was gonna go visit my parents for a few, but then I'll probably have to like just be there for a little bit and then leave because I do, like I said, I do have to make it to a rehearsal and then to sing and minister and all that stuff. But let me take my vitaminas um vitamin c zinc and what is this main magic tinctures tinctures oh my god this is terrible but basically it's like um you add these drops it's like you create your own little tonic to be able to put into um your little vitamin mixture and that has to do that one is like hair growth and stuff like that 
so my hair is kind of growing um and this is the zinc that i take from mary roots and obviously the multivitamin i take is just the regular one from women's i mean from whole foods the multivitamin and the uh, b12 oh i threw that out but it's just like the regular b12 um and then i'm finishing out this d vitamin d3 um droplet situation because y'all know from the last time i'll tag the video here um if you didn't see but my iron levels were really low my vitamin d was really low um until i actually had to like rectify it and i'm better now so i'm gonna finish that one up and then i'll just stick to my regular vitamins good morning my friends what is up well i'm saying good morning like y'all are actually gonna watch this in the morning you may not watch this in the morning i'm not sure so i don't know what is happening on the outside of my house right now but oh snap my alarm was going off but they're doing like some sort of construction i'm sure you guys hear what's happening so i won't talk long but i'm sitting here with my coffee um i know i'm weird i'm literally sipping it with a straw only because like i'm trying to work on like um my teeth like the t like you know coffee drinkers and tea drinkers y'all know what's up y'all know what's up and so i'm just like working on my teeth getting brighter whiter more lovely anyway i have these glass uh straws that i love so much uh but anyway like i said today is a day in a life it's actually going to be a few days into one because today this morning i have an event um sephora is coming to kohl's amen so if you're a kohl's lover a kohl's shopper you are and you love sephora sephora is now going to be in kohl's so i am going to be going to an event today and i figured like i just vlog and bring you guys with me but i'm gonna do my makeup real quick like literally i have to do it real quick like i'm gonna snap my fingers and i'm gonna be done just like that i don't have a lippy on though because i'm gonna have to have a mask on um when i i'm in my uber <laughs> and i mean i'm gonna put some like vaseline on or whatever but i'm gonna finish getting ready i have my skims like one piece on today and i'm gonna have like a like oversized like cargo looking moment over it I'm
y'all, I'm so excited that I'm finally done with this shoot. This was like the final top that I put on. Um, if you don't know, like this shade of like green is like one of my main brand colors. So whenever I'm out and about, I actually do intentionally pick up clothing like that. It's only because like you don't have to be that like strategic when it comes to your stuff but i am very much um i have the brain of a strategist but i tried to remain on the not so crazy side of that <laughs> but anyway i am finally done and i think now it's just i had to do some filming today um I did some filming today, probably later on. I do like natural lighting, but today's lighting has been so on and off that I rather just um, go based off of like artificial light. So that's what I'll pull out later on tonight. Um, there's so many exciting things happening. So the shoot for today was mainly for something that um, that I'm gonna launch within these next few days, which I guess like. If you're following me on Instagram, you might know exactly what it is. I think it's, like, pretty obvious. But um, I'll share more information with you guys here. Look at my phone just, like, chilling on the thing. Um, yeah, so that was pretty fun. It's always fun shooting with Fabiani. She just gets it. I've been working with her for years. And she just really gets it. So my sister is on her way to come get me. And we're going to go out to eat which is going to be really interesting because i am on keto and i have decided to do more like pescatarian keto kind of thing so it's going to be interesting to kind of find ways to make that work for me um but i'm only going to do keto for maybe a few more weeks just to see like what it does and i know i've talked about it here i think the main thing why i decided to do keto was because i felt like my weight kind of plateaued and i kind of wanted to just like do something different and i also more on like the deeper side i find that when i get really disciplined about um certain areas of my life it naturally um what was the word it naturally kind of bleeds over i hate that word but it kind of like bleeds over to the next area and so because i have such a pre precision for these next few months you know the book writing that has to be on a deadline like all that good stuff you know it needs to happen so here we are i am going to change so i can go out to eat my room is in shambles because i am getting rid of um some clothes that i just don't use anymore there was my peloton she misses me so much but yeah that's that's what's going on right now wow literally that's ghetto like i gotta put this nail back on but my home is somewhat in shambles ever since the photo shoot from the other day i um pretty much have a bunch of products here that the kohl's and sephora um or my friends over at Kohl's and Sephora were able to gift me from the event that I went to last week. And so really dope things. I tried this eyeliner the other day and it was actually really, really good. And it's called, it's by, it's by Makeup by Mario. <laughs> and this is the perfect brown um, eyeliner pencil. It's so good, y'all. I wore it yesterday and it, it was really good. They also gifted us like a beauty blender, a bunch of other things. And my favorite fragrance at the moment, like in real life, this thing smells so good. Y'all have to try it immediately. <laughs> so I had just received my groceries from Amazon. So I'm going to show you guys like what I get so that you have an idea of like what I'm kind of like eating right now. Let me go ahead and grab my little tripod so that I can place it and just show you guys like what I'm getting these days. It's funny because I feel like the last time that I did kind of like a grocery haul, I had this same outfit on. Am I right or am I wrong? Let me close this door. 
So let's just see what we got here. All right, I've been loving this granola and it is keto friendly. Um, this is the granola, it's by Purely Elizabeth. Oh, and everything, I don't know if I mentioned it, but everything I got was from like the Amazon um, Whole Foods delivery. I also got these keto bites which are peanut butter chocolate chip cookie dough i have a sweet tooth y'all and i'm a bit of a snacker so it's very important for me to have things prepared because y'all um and this is not like my full like groceries i just got this because um i just needed a few small things and i needed to get them immediately so this is a sort of cereal I'm gonna try it this is the only thing so far that I've actually had before everything else is probably like low-key new this is something new this is the vital proteins collagen creamer so what I am gonna get is the um, what is it called like the stir the battery operated stir stir for it not to like when I you know like when you put the powder in a liquid it ends up looking like clunky chunky kind of thing so what i am gonna order from amazon is like one of those um it's not a frother but it is like to spin things and to mix it well i'm gonna be putting this into my coffee because it is a creamer so i'm actually i might try it today even though i don't have that these are the avocados i got the little baby ones i got these unsweetened chocolate chip cookies um they are keto friendly. I actually have the monk fruit sweetener, I think by that brand as well. I got a low carb um, tomato sauce. It's a marinara sauce. And it's for like when I do like little cauliflower pizzas or um, I don't know if I, if I decide to do some sort of keto pasta or something like that. Honestly, I don't know what I'm doing, y'all. Like, I don't know what I'm doing. All I'm trying to do is make sure that I stay under a certain amount of carbs a day. I don't even know if it's officially keto at this point because, yeah, I do have some eggs. Eggs. I'm going to speed this up. I got this uh, Califia coconut milk. This is one of my favorite milks of all time. I got the... Uh, Fragera, wait, Fora, Froger, Froger Project Yogurt. Um, I actually like the drinkable one. It literally says drinkable. But th what I do with this is I add this to my, um, my smoothie so that they're a little bit more heftier. And then the Daya cheese that's made with the chickpea, it melts so well now. Like, they changed the recipe, and it's really, really good. So I add this to either eggs or, like, a quesadilla or um, the little pizzas that I was talking about. And the tortillas that I use for the quesadillas, if I do make it like that, or, like, a tuna melt, are these by Mission. They're low carb. Like I said, y'all, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just, I'm just testing it all out. So, if you are down for the cause of testing it out, these are the things that I'm trying. So, you know, all of the professionals <laughs> that may be watching this, like, this is just a girl trying to figure it out, and I'm sharing my journey. Um, and if you have no idea what I'm talking about, I pretty much decided that I wanted to try keto. I'm trying keto just because my weight was at like a plateau. And so I wanted to really like snatch myself up for a temporary amount of time. This is dope that they kept the ice cream cold in this. This is the low carb keto ice cream by Mammoth. And it's vanilla bean. And it's only like net two carbs and that is impeccable so and like i said i got a sweet tooth so what i end up doing is um i put a little or whatever the serving size is of this into this like whatever the serving size is for this and it this granola with this vanilla bean wow it is incredible so i think that's everything for 
the groceries. I'm going to try this probably next. And if anybody wants to know, like I'm doing the intermittent fasting from, I started it from like 12 to 7, I think it is, 12 to 8, 12 to 7, something like that. But now I'm actually able to hold off a little longer because I really am not a breakfast person. Like in real life, I'm just not a breakfast person. And so I pretty much start eating around like one two o'clock ish and so like i said this isn't for everybody this is like literally me trying to um come up off this plateau and trying to get my body the way that i feel like i really want it so i'm not really even doing strenuous workouts just cycling and doing all that good stuff so if y'all have any wow lighting if you guys have any recommendations for keto friendly things or whatever please drop it in the comments because maybe I'm doing it all wrong. And if I am, your help is needed. So, <laughs> so please do that. Yeah, let me get to get to working out right now.